A Trump rioter had a complete meltdown after he was refused a flight following the Capitol insurrection. Take a look. I love every single one of you, but this is what they do to us. They kick me off the plane, they call me a fucking terrorist, and they want to fucking ruin my life. Oops. They want to ruin my life. I mean, th that's what he's saying. I, they want to ruin my I can't believe that. I can't believe something bad can happen to me after I invaded the Capitol. Uh, you took part of an insurrection. Yeah, you're, it looks like you might be the one that has ruined your own life, sir. Also, this is Wendy's. I love I love the crying Nazis. I love it. Oh my god, every time. Every time one of these tough guys. This I, and and I knew a guy like this before, right? A guy so tough. Oh, I'm so I'm so tough. I'll kick your ass off. I'll god get you know. Yeah, I'll I'll take on anybody. And then they go to jail for a day or they they actually face the consequences of their action and they're a bawling mess. Cry. Oh, they cry so much. They cried, I can't believe you would ruin my life like that. Oh, how dare I have to face the consequences of my own actions? It's so unfair. Snowflakes. Sad. Baby. Look, don't blame that, st that shit on anybody else, buddy. That is all on you. I mean, what happened? What happened to personal responsibility? And, and I can tell you one thing, okay? So many of these people have never faced any consequences for the stuff that they do, for their actions, okay? And it's so obvious that they have relied on strictly in their privilege. Remember, these people are not working class folks. Now, anybody who tells you that, oh, this is, this is a forgotten men and women, it's a working class, it's a working class rebellion. No, it's not. It never was. It never was. Some of these people took private jets to be there. Obviously not this guy. Um, but some... Many took days off, you know, work uh, to go and cosplay revolutionary. You think somebody who's holding down two jobs, who's behind on their bills, behind on their rent, uh, is going to pony up all that money to go and, and fly to D.C. to cosplay? No, 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 no. Th these people, most of these people are upper crust. OK, that's what they are. They're the business owners, the business class. Okay, this is the bourgeois, all right? Uh, they're not screaming about $2,000 checks because they're too busy screaming N-words uh, at the, uh, at, at, you know, at black security guards, at Capitol Police. While ransacking the place on video, they have literally made documentation of their own crimes. And yet, after all of that, what, what you think you're going to get away with no consequences, with zero consequences? Now, to me, that, that video is so, you know, it, it's fucking awesome, and I love it, because finally, some of these people are actually facing consequences when they thought that they were above the law. And then they're, they're over here like, no, 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 you don't understand, I'm not a terrorist. How could you call me a terrorist? I'm just defending Donald Trump. Only brown people are terrorists, and black people are the thugs. I'm the patriot here. Why are you treating me so badly? I'm not one of, I'm a real American. I'm not a cut soy boy lib. How dare you not let me on the plane? Why? You want to ruin my life? No, dude. You fucked around. And now you're finding out. I know. And it, he's not the only one. He's not the first. He's not going to be the last. Okay. So many of these people have been arrested and charged and are very, very surprised that this happened. Like, oh my God. How? How, how could this how could this ever happen to me? You haven't been paying uh, attention to BLM and you know how they get treated for actually you know 93 percent of all those uh, BLM protests 100 percent peaceful involving millions and millions of people and then you get a bunch of MAGA chuds together and they ransack the capital. Who are the real violent ones? Who are the real violent ones? Yeah, of course. And again, they're dumb enough to document their own crimes because they think that they're above the law. Well, obviously, 
we know that's not true. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and share with your friends. You can subscribe and help out the channel by becoming a patron. It's patreon.com slash Jeff Waldorf, or you can become a channel member as well by hitting the join button below.